By mid-2022, the Beaver County Petrochemical Plant will be up and running. Are we ready if something goes wrong? It's next to Route 376 on the south side of the Ohio River. It will store over 15,000 tons of flammable and explosive liquid ethane. If its largest ethane tank explodes, there could be a 3,000-foot diameter fireball and windows shattered a mile from the plant. But let's look at a more ordinary accident, one that happened in 2018 in Port Neches, Texas. Three workers saw a pipe break and ran. The broken pipe released 15 tons of flammable vapor that exploded two minutes later. That explosion damaged nearby houses and a school and broke more pipes within the plant. The next afternoon's explosion launched one of the plant's towers into the air. You can see the tower, maybe 10 tons of steel, flying like a rocket, trailing flames. Fortunately, it landed inside the plant. The town was evacuated and schools were closed for a week, but it was a month before the last flames went out. The air cleared and nearby roads reopened. So we're wondering, is Beaver County ready for this? Will our fire departments and EMTs be trained and equipped? Remember, our health is not part of Shell's bottom line. <laughs>